Ons Jabeur versus Beatrice Adaj Meyer is the third quarter final for the ladies event at the French Open for 2023. And both ladies have had different roads to get to this stage. Adaj Meyer started the tournament off against Tatiana Maria in the first round. This is no problem for Meyer, getting through in straights, six love, six one. In the second round, she'd take on Snader, and this was a battle. After dropping the second set, she'd fight back to win, six two, five seven, six four. In the third round, she'd take on the 23rd seed, Alexandrova. And after dropping the first set, she was forced to fight back, five seven, six four, seven five. In the fourth round, she'd take on Tormo, who was fortunate enough to avoid Rabakina, who had to retire from the event in the previous round. And again, after her dad's Meyer lost the first, she would fight back to win in a three-hour, 50-minute match, 6-7, 6-3, 7-5, to advance to the quarterfinals. Jabir entered the tournament as a number seven seed and would take on Bronzetti in the first round. This was no problem for Jabir, winning in straights, 6-4, 6-1. In the second round, she'd take on Dodden. And again, this is no problem for Jabir, winning in straights, 6-2, 6-3. In the third round, she'd take on the qualified Danilovic. And after dropping her first set for the week, Jabir would fight back to win 4-6, 6-4, 6-2. In the fourth round, she'd take on Pera, who had taken out Vekic along the way. After a close first set, though, Jabir got it together in the second, getting through in straights, 6-3, 6-1, to get to the French Open quarterfinals. These two have played twice before, with Jabir leading the head-to-head 2-0, which includes a match a couple of weeks ago in Stuttgart, where Jabir won 6-3, 6 love against Adaj Maia on the clay. If Adaj is going to win this one, she needs to get the first set. She's kind of lost the first set in the last couple of matches and she's had to fight back to win and I don't know how many matches she's got left in her by playing those four hour matches she can't keep doing that against everybody if she's going to win this title so she's got to get off to a better start against Jabir if Jabir's going to win this one she needs to keep the variety the drop shots and moving Adaj Meyer around she'll be able to do that more so against her than somebody else because Adaj Meyer's movement isn't as good as some of the smaller players that she's played but she has played players like Adaj Meyer, the big lefties. So moving her around, doing the drop shots, lots of variety, should work for Jabir. This is such a fun matchup. Interesting matchup too, because of course, Rabakina was in this section. And it's great to see Jabir back into a quarterfinal of a slam. First time since the US Open last year. But I'm going to go with Jabir to win this one in three. I think Adaj Meyer's had a great tournament. But I think that last match being nearly a four-hour match might catch up with her against Jabir. And Jabir will win this one in three sets. But let me know down in the comments below who's going to win this quarterfinal.